press and go harder and in, into good pace drilling. And then, you know, we'll save, we'll have time for live wrestling every day too. So, um, you know, as far as when you're in, when you're around here, okay, when you're around here in the building, just the main things you wanna uh, focus on, okay, is uh, keeping things clean. You know, keeping things clean. If you, if you have if you have garbage, if you have trash, you know, just putting it away. Uh, even even sometimes, you know, like I'm, our our staff is our, our rule is if you know you see something, somebody leaves an ice bag there or something. Even if it's not yours, we usually try to just put it in the in the trash bag. Just because we want to keep having camp. And, you know, we want the people that let us have the camp to allow us to keep happening. So we got a lot of kids here today from different places. I'm excited. Some of them I know more than others. But we got a chance to all come together and, uh, you know, get a lot better over these next three days. We got some really good clinicians and coaches and people to help uh, lined up here for you. Okay, the ones that are here right now and some will be coming in um, today and over the next couple days. Okay, probably the main guy you need to know right here, right now, is uh, Coach Lamer. This is Chad Lamer. We coach together here at Crescent Valley. And if you need something, really, you know, probably ask one of us to. We know the ins and the outs of the school and stuff like that. Um, so, Chad wrestled for South Dakota State. He was a three-time national champion for them. Um, he was a... Uh, university age uh, freestyle world champion and you know some of you guys might know his boys and stuff we uh, can we get chance over here today he left yesterday. Oh, I thought he was leaving today I wanted to give him a send-off okay chance just made the cadet world team so he's getting ready to go to Croatia for the world championships uh, so we're excited about that he's, he's one of our guys here. okay uh, Hey, Tom. Okay. Hey, Tom and Pavel. They're all the way from Russia. Okay. They're from Yakuts. Um, Eastern, Eastern Russia, Siberia. Okay. So they've got a lot of experience. Uh, they're going to be learning folk style here this week with us a little bit. But freestyle. And uh, some of you guys are getting ready for Fargo and stuff. I'm gonna probably break you guys off, maybe this afternoon's workout, get you with these guys a little bit, working on your parterre and stuff, okay? Uh, you know, we're gonna have Coach Vidlak coming in, we're gonna have Coach Huffman, we're gonna have the American Gangster, Chael P. Sonnen this afternoon. Uh, we got P.A. Ray! Stand up, Ray, stand up. Ray, P.A. Ray from Pennsylvania is one of our coaches here at Crescent Valley. He wrestled for Johns Hopkins University. He's one of the nicest guys you will ever find on earth. He really is, man. We love having him in our program here. He can still get in there and hammer the little guys, okay? And uh, he's an awesome guy. Ray is one of the, he's the smart guy of the staff, okay? So we have a guy that cracks backs, okay? We have a guy that just talks the whole time and, and just is crazy about wrestling. And then we have an engineer, okay? We've got an engineer, that's what he is by trade, and then he comes in. And we got a farmer. We've got a great American farmer about two miles down the road that helps us too. And we used his big <coughs> farming truck to move all these mats, okay? So we're gonna keep these mats clean. Um, you know, just make sure you can use the locker rooms, you can use the bathrooms, just when you use the bathroom, even if you're a germ phobe, flush it with your foot, okay? We gotta have those things flushed. Okay, Barnes, Barnes, well, don't be overfilling that thing. <laughs> Up in Spokane, we had a big problem. One of, the, one of the motel rooms, the whole thing got overflowed. Yeah, Barnes, I, he was in the room, I don't know if it was him or not. Was it David? Okay, so I don't know how many how many guys we have here. How many kids we have here? At least 130. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, first time camp here, and 
we're going to do our best, work our butts off, so you got a great experience. Uh, we are going to have some opportunity for a little spike ball in between sessions. I think we might have some bean bags. We got, we got some stuff. Okay. So, all right. Any questions? Mario, you always have a question. Yeah, Mario. There may be. There's not yet. We got to get the wrestling in first. And we got some other guys that I'll introduce as they come in, like Coach Huffman when he comes in. Um, you know, we're going to have some other guys helping too, probably. Okay? Some of them are around and, and, and uh, you know, have Coach, we've got Coach Lopez up there from, uh, from North Medford. He's here with his team. Uh, so we got some other guys here too. And the most important guy this session, come on out, Strider. Okay? Strider here. I told him 9.30 this morning. Because... Uh, yeah, I know. I started coaching this guy about 20 years ago. Yeah, about 20 years ago, and he is notoriously just barely on time, or maybe just a little bit late. Yeah. He did. So I told him 9:30, and he showed up here at 9:53, just in time for session. Okay. Strider is the coach at Silverton High School. He wrestled, uh, I got to coach him, like I said, uh, 17, 18 years ago, something like that. He was a four-time All-American in college, two-time national champ, and uh, he runs a gym now up near Silverton, Salem, Salem, Grit Fitness. He's a great personal trainer, um, and, and then, like I said, he's a, he's a wrestling coach. So he's, uh, he's got a great top series. Okay, so he's got a great top series, and that's what we're going to start off with this morning. And it'll get you guys kind of warmed up, and then as the day goes on, get ready for hammer time. Okay, get ready for hammer time. Okay?